Uh, how you doing? Good morning. Good, Good morning. to be oh, back wow. with you all. Beautiful. Good to have you I back. Come on, come on, Reese. Don't I, I, I just said it's good to have you back. That's all I said. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know you were going to come with a little bit of <laughs> best time, I miss we, you, best. I'm glad we get you out of the stadium um, since you seem to live there now. <laughs> I know, right? I was like, God, Lee, I was just here yesterday. It's, but off day today before I got to go back tomorrow. But yes, it's, the grind continues. All know? right. We going to do a little game over, game over today? Game game on, game yes. over? All right. What you got? Yes, we are. All right. The Panthers, they dropped their season opening game to the Browns 26-24. This is not news, <clears throat> right? We know that. Uh, some fans have already turned on the team, though, mm-hmm. and head coach Matt Rule. Matt Rule says he's not discouraged, though. We're obviously disappointed. This is a quote from Matt Rule. But we're not discouraged, he said uh, yesterday. There are so many places where we're better than last year. So I'm going to ask you guys, game on or game over, that it's too early to write off Rule and the Panthers. Mm. Game, game over for me on that one. Mm. You, so you said time to write them off? It's one game. I'm, yeah, I'm I mean, this. but my thing is, tell me what's the difference between this year and, and, and the last game. Yeah, we bought the same thing. <laughs> Like for real though. I mean, we, seriously. We 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 got the one with the bigger packaging, the different the different colors, mm-hmm. but it's the same taste. Right. Well, I, it's a different well, person. In defense of the Panthers, it really isn't the same. Last year, they would get a lead and then lose the lead and then lose the game. The, on Sunday, they didn't start off fast. They were able to come back, which is something they weren't able to do in the past, really. And then they ended up. Yeah, like like you said, they had the league and they ended up losing the game. That's exactly what they did (laughs) on Sunday. I'm going game on. I think it's one game. Thank you. Thank you, Pam. I I say for me it's 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 game same. Because, I mean, <laughs> that is not a question. That I mean, but it's just, I mean, it's it, it can't be hitting a game over too soon. It, it can't be any of those things because this is exactly what we thought they would be. This team is going to be exactly what we thought a 500 team point blank period. That's it. And we can't say that, you no, know, the reason they weren't successful last year because uh. Christian McCaffrey uh, wasn't on the field. He was on the field last night. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's on Sunday. A lot. So, so, <laughs> so, so we got to come up with another excuse now. Uh, that's, that, he was not on the field a lot on Sunday. I think that might have been part of the problem. You know, he only had, what, four snaps in the first half oh, of the game. Uh, so there's yeah, a balance the between, and I think the Panthers are trying to figure that out, okay. the balance between properly using Christian McCaffrey and not overusing Christian mm. McCaffrey. So, you know, their complaints about, oh, you're running him into the ground. Well, you know, four snaps in the first half and look look what happened. And then he started making things happen offensively. So I think that Rule and McAdoo have to go back to the drawing board and figure out, okay, how do we use Christian McCaffrey? How do we use uh, Freeman? How do we use LaVishka Chenault, who they just signed? Um, as another offensive weapon, but how do we use these guys in order to um, in order to release the load on Christian, but still have him in when they need explosive plays? So we'll see. But you know, I'm with Pam. It's game one, you know. And, I mean, and granted, the Panthers do have the longest losing streak in the league right now. They've lost eight games in a row, <laughs> going back so, to last year. Wow, so, I did not so, know that. I did not know that. So, so yeah, I had to drop a little fact. Well, 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 let me drop a let me drop a fact. I think what I said was was very very poor. I said it's the same as that's what, as we see. I mean, it's, it's been Christian last year. I might need to backtrack after, you, that, you after, after hor- that fun fact. You are a horrible defense attorney. <laughs> he lied. No, at, but listen, how many how many times have I changed y'all's minds on things? Just that's true. Let me let me let me, let me let, it's game one. Okay. okay? The Panthers show the ability to battle back. That is something that they weren't able to do underneath Sam Darnold. Baker Mayfield is still a better quarterback. They have to sure up that, that run true. game. The run game was very was not very good. Uh, and, you know, although the offensive line looks better, I have not seen a – last season, I did not see a team that could battle back and take a lead mm-hmm. late in the fourth quarter. How did a young fellow so, play? How, how did a young fellow from NC State play? Icky gave, Icky gave up a couple of sacks. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, Rule defended him yesterday and said, though, that he was supposed to get help on a couple of those. 
So Rule said he okay. did, you know, he did decent for a Good. rookie going up against the best yeah. pass rusher yeah. in the league. Yeah, they didn't uh, embarrass him. I put it easier. that way. Yeah, okay. he did. You know, Icky wasn't Icky. It wasn't like, oh my gosh, you know. It, okay. Good for him. No. Good it, for him. Yeah. Yeah. So, all right. Speaking, we're talking about. I heard y'all talking about yesterday's game. There's been a lot of talk about the game management and and KP. You know, you gave. I mean, KP, K Mac. You gave a good point about the analytics. Y'all were trashing K Mac's point about the analytics, but a lot of these GMs and even um, even owners play up the fact that they want these guys to be more analytical in their mm-hmm. play calling. So the analytics said thirty to twenty nine that you kicked the field goal in that situation. I don't agree with it, but mm-hmm. well, well, K-Mac but when you have but when you have no feel for your team and. You I gotta be struggling all day, but <laughs> but you go to say. Wait a minute, Russell. Wilson, how long Russell Wilson been playing in the league? Ten years. Oh. Yeah. So he, so so you, you don't have a feel for Russell Wilson? Are you kidding me? Didn't you look? Yeah, they paid him all that money. They did not look like they were in sync last K-Mac. night. K Mac. They just five didn't. Yards. They just really? didn't. They didn't. Look I, like I they thought they looked in sync. Uh, up until the side of the five yard line, I mean, Williams, Williams <laughs> catching one those, yard line. <laughs> yeah, we we Williams was catching those uh, balls in the flat, making getting five ten yards, breaking tackles. You get yeah, it? Yeah, but me? he fumbled at he fumbled at the guard inside the, the five the yard line. line. I'm talking about I'm talking about outside the five yard line. That they, they was unbelievable inside the five it yard. Line. It doesn't yeah. make any difference if you can't score the football. They had like three opportunities. Tr- they I, fumbled I, on I'm the I'm trying to get five yards. I'm trying to get five yards, mm-hmm. to get five yards mm-hmm. for the first down. Do you right. I think I think they should have gone. They should have. You go for it on fourth down. Mm-hmm. You got all your timeouts. Yeah. You, you go for it on right, fourth down. But anyway, Russell Wilson, he made his return to Seattle after signing with the Broncos. He was booed by Seahawks fans. So he was booed during warm-ups. He was booed mm-hmm. during a coin toss. He was that. booed when he took the field. Mm-hmm. Many thought it was a tacky move by the 12th man. I'm going to ask you guys, game on and game over to Seahawks fans booing Russell Wilson. Game over. Game, game over. over. Game tacky. over for me. Yeah. Jackie. He, yep. get, he gave the them something they ain't had there. in a long right. time. And so were they supposed to cheer for him? Because he asked out of he asked out of Seattle. Well, well they asked first. They, and, he, and he didn't say nothing. He, and he didn't snitch on them. He didn't tell nobody when they had to get rid of him when they were trying to, you know, trade him uh, years ago. And he knew all about that. He didn't tell. He didn't go. Out, he didn't come out crying about that. He, he brought them a championship. That's right. For the first, first for the franchise and had the opportunity to get another one. His, his coach blew that one. Cause right. they, he want to make Marshall Lynch a hero, so I mean, yeah, Russell was good by them. Not you don't have to boo him. You ain't got to clap for him, but you don't have to boo him. That's right, my point. Right. I actually agree with that. Yeah, I think yeah. that's a tacky move. This guy was the face yeah, of the franchise better. for years. Right. Like Russell Wilson was the man in Seattle. The one time I went to Seattle, that's all I saw was Russell Wilson jerseys, right. and then he returns for the first time, and y'all boo him. That's why you know. That's why you don't. You you know you aren't faithful to these. I was gonna say another thing, but I can't say that on the air. Yeah, <laughs> but, but you're right. But, but you're exactly right. That's where you get your money, uh, L- Lamar Jackson. Uh, don't be right. faithful. I mean, you get your pay because the fans they'll they'll, they'll switch you in a minute. What have you done for me lately, attitude? <laughs> he ain't faithful. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's what I was gonna say. Okay, Mac, thank you. Thank you. All right. Hey, that's, 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 that's a Chris Brown song. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. <laughs> Might have to bump back I in with that if I can find a clean one. Yeah, version. clean it. Find, find a clean, clean one. I, I had to keep it ladylike, so I'm glad that you guys didn't have to do so on my behalf. Don't worry, we got you. We got you. <laughs> I know y'all do. That was good. All right, y'all mentioned it a little earlier, but Nebraska, they have an opening at head coach, mm. NC State head coach Dave Duran, who – has Midwestern roots, I must add. He's been linked to the job already. I think he Eurostepped the question when he asked if he was interested in the job, basically saying that he was fired up for his game this week. Um, he did say so, no, that he's excited about playing. But I ask you guys, game on or game over, to Doran taking the Nebraska job if they throw the bag at him. Well, hold on. Let me, let me ask you guys a question before you answer this. Which job is bigger? Mm. No, Nebraska is bigger. That Big Ten yeah. money don't lie. Yeah, Big okay, Ten. Okay, yeah, okay. Ten, yeah. Yeah. Right. Nebraska. So, but so, I think Doran likes State more. I couldn't see. I couldn't see him leaving. Yeah, I well, heard it depends that. on State. How many season? times have we heard that about a coach? Y'all gonna say <laughs> seriously? Right. I mean, come on now, come on now. Yeah. Everybody love on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> then that bag comes through, right? And, and Honey says, hey, I mean, no, <laughs> no Nebraska <laughs> must, is, is a much bigger program. Yeah. But the past two seasons, Boo Corrigan has given uh, Dave Dorner raise in his contract. Okay. Y- y'all just answered the question. Okay. 
you just hit Nebraska was bigger. Yeah. So whatever the hell they offering over there at NC State right. should not compare to what you just said right. Big Ten. Money. They can't. Mm-hmm. They can't co- co- compete. Shouldn't. They can't compete. And if I was Dave Durham White right now, I'd be looking at him crazy. So That's right. What's it's the game on? Honey. What's the question, uh, Vesta? What what's the game on? Uh, that he that he leaves if yeah. Nebraska throws the yeah. bag at him. Game on. Game yeah. on. Yeah. Game on. Would he leave in the middle of the season? Oh no, 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 no. He won't do that. Well, you know what? That, that'd be now I that mean, here we go, here we go. They take, fart? To, my, to my being booed. <laughs> or shot. <laughs> oh God, yes. I, I think that's that's a class. I, I don't no, no, that, I don't that, like that move. That that, mm-hmm. that won't happen because I, you, like I mean that. you you got you gotta have some respect to the for yeah, the organization like that. that you mm-hmm. work for. Come on. Yeah. And shame on all of you guys. What about Mickey? Mickey's interim head coach right now from Nebraska. Get a brother a chance, man. Mickey, Mickey who? Mickey who? Who are you talking about? We don't know Mickey. Who is Mickey? Yeah, who, are they, are they, who the hell is Mickey? Mouse? I, 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 I went to school with a guy named Mickey. Who the hell is Mickey? I like Mickey. I, I'm, I'm Googling. I'm checking my notes. Check Mickey. out Mickey, man. You know the guy. You know the coach. Let me look. I forgot his last name. I didn't say it right there. Is his first name Mickey? No, it's Joseph. That's it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, Mickey Mouse. Y'all what? know Mickey. You know, Ricky, Ricky know Mickey Joseph. I do. He played in the NFL. Okay. Yeah. I, I guess I do, but yeah. it's okay though. It's alright. Y'all, y'all just won't get a brother a chance, man. Y'all always talk about a white, giving no. African Americans the opportunity to be head coach. Now look at y'all. Gotta be y'all y'all, they y'all trying to get the Matt room. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Speaking of that, Notre Dame's coach, boy, oh boy. Yeah, Nebraska's open. <laughs> but no, the thing, the situation. Well, yeah, that's that's tough. Uh, He's in a tough position. Yeah, well, you, I, I, you can't lose. Can't lose to Marshall though. Just can't lose to Marshall. You can. Yeah, but you should. Yeah, so they've sorry. lost two in a row. Oh, and two, you know those boots. Well, you know they won't go win the first one anyway. So I you mean, knew you, that. the Ohio State. I mean, that's okay. That's a push, but 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 Marshall. Yeah, we, we are Marshall. Come on. Anyway, so okay. if he loses two more games, what y'all think? No, he got to win the next one. Yeah. And then he just he wow. lost his quarterback. The quarterback is hurt too. Quarterback is out for like yeah, four, out for the season. like yeah. like four he's, months. He's gone. What gives me? Like, they said four months. Why did I just say the damn season? <laughs> <laughs> right. He's out for four months. Well, yeah. because if he makes it to postseason, come on, man. If they make it to the wow. Come on, man. They got to win out at this point. <laughs> I mean, come on now. No, the, the, the sad part about this is that Ty, Tyron Willingham was a great coach. And they won Ever with him. since that time. And they didn't want him. They fired him and brought in the big boy. I can't remember his name. Yep, uh, let him go. From New England. Weiss. Weiss. Charlie Weiss, who was Weiss. terrible. Yep. I mean, ridiculous. Yep. So that's why I wanted this young man to, to, to be successful mm-hmm. this time. But well, I don't know. start over. <laughs> like, literally start over. Like, literally. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's what I don't like. See, now you give, you give, you give, uh, 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 down in Charlotte, uh, what's it? Uh, Matt Rule. Matt Rule, you know, a nod because he rebuilt, you know, Baylor. When Baylor, he just yeah. found out that he had a, what, a 500 well, yeah, but, but he, 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 he I mean, built it from the ground. Well, no, no, come on. No, 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 no. <laughs> Notre Dame came in as, what, a top 10 team Five. In the no, they, they came in as They fifth. were number five, right? Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They were ranked number. This is not a rebuild project. Mm-hmm. You don't rebuild Notre Dame. Notre Dame was built for years ago. Decades ago. All right, I you try. Okay, I tried, man. And you get better at Notre Dame. <laughs> hey, Vet. Hey, Vet's time. There's no such thing. I, I brought up that, uh, you know, three of my coaches that, that won't be there next year is, is Rule was one of them. And then I said, uh, 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 Mike McCarthy and there's a couple other ones. Um, is Rule been rumored to maybe Nebraska next coach? Oh, they've been talking about it, of course. Okay. I think okay. any college, any college opening that comes up, uh, Rule's name will be linked to. And there's absolutely no doubt in my mind that if Rule does not survive in Carolina, that he will be right back on the college level and he'll be successful there. Texas A&M will be open. I think, I think, I think he even said last year that he can get in the college coaching job yeah. he, he wanted. Yeah, he said that. He told that to the players. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wow. We'll take your ass home. <laughs> like, bye. Bye. bye, Felicia. <laughs> yeah, man, I, I, now, see. Don't get me. Okay, anyway, Vest, I was. <laughs> Don't get me started on that. <laughs> he getting fired up now. <laughs> All right, back to the Panthers. So starting faster, we talked about how they started slowly, had to make a comeback. Um, Baker Mayfield, he struggled in the first half, but he led that late charge late in the third and the fourth quarter. After the game, Rule mentioned that limited stats from Mayfield uh, that he took with the starters. He said, you know, he's only taking about 30 to 40 snaps with the starters. Um, may have affected. There were some timing issues. 
um, and also may have affected the slow start. But he also defended the quarterback competition that limited those snaps. So I ask you guys, game on or game over, that the prolonged quarterback competition during training camp hurt the Panthers uh, in their first game of the season? No more than anybody else. That's the thing. It's not I – mean, they are, I mean, we've seen – everybody, we got a chance to watch the first week, right? Right. Everybody had the same yeah. type Y'all said game over to that, that, yeah. that, that question. Everybody had the same. Yeah. Like, like, there's no reason to look for, like, this this silver bullet of why they lost the game or why it was so – they didn't play horrible. They didn't play terrible. The problem is they don't look like a dominating team like Kansas City look, like the Buffalo Bills look, and they won't, and they will not, and they will never look like that. So stop expecting that. Wow. Mm. They just I don't know if road. anybody expects that. Well, I mean, but that's what what's all they're complaining about. You, this team, no. this team they looks like this team to win. But there's also the Rams loss, uh, the Packers loss. Every quarterback who faced their former team, uh, Russell Wilson, mm-hmm. Flacco, mm. and Mayfield, Ooh, they Flacco, all Flacco, lost. Flacco. It's, it's, it's week one. Right. But I, I think that I, I personally say game on to it. I, I think that the, the quarterback competition should have, I mean, it should have going into New England. A starting quarterback should have been named, and that way you allow your time. I mean, you get your you. Well, y'all do anything to fire man. You get comfortable. I just think I just I thought that I thought that they 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 didn't have to drag that along as long as they did. The writing was already on the wall with that one or mm. early on. So you know you can't mm-hmm. talk about limited snaps, <clears throat> and then you had a quarterback competition that lasted um, past the third past the second preseason game. Good point. All right, Vash, we're up against you know. it. Awesome. Great job, as always. Thank you for coming on. I appreciate Thank it. Thank you. <laughs> Reese, please. Come on, Reese. I know. Vash, it wouldn't be me unless I give, give oh. you a little bit for your lead. Vash, I said That's publicly, fine. you were right. I did accuse the Panthers of not having any actual offensive weapons, and you did point out DJ Moore yes. and uh, Robbie. And I well, DJ, Robbie, well, Christian McCaffrey. Was DJ on the field, though? They didn't even use him that much. Right, because they, yeah, they, 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 they did it to Robbie. They didn't use – yeah, they yeah. didn't use a lot of their weapons. Yeah. Uh, Robbie was the most targeted Panther. But he also had a 75-yard touchdown, 121 yards total. So. Wow. They got scared. Mm-hmm. You know what? They I thought about weapons. it. I was sitting there they, like, have, they have weapons mm-hmm. on offense. They just need – a quarterback who can get the ball over the line of scrimmage yeah, he and not might, get it batted yeah. down. There you go. He's like 4 2. Yeah. <laughs> hey, look, <laughs> the, hey, look, I pulled a Reese so that was gay. I said, damn, I'm going to have to apologize to Bash Town. <laughs> <laughs> I said, this ain't good. I know, that happens a lot over the weekend. Exactly. Yeah. I, feel, I know, I'm used to that, y'all. I'm used to that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> bye, bye. 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 Bye.